you know, in the hard truth, you see no one just kind of chilling here for a second. Uh, I don't know what time it is, middle of the afternoon, crap the uh, power crunch bar, metrics bar, it's sort of a legs workout this morning, just took the dog for a hike, walk along the trails here, and it's like, uh, you know, I almost, I, um, I lean more towards the gym stuff and the obstacle course, of course, for this, you know, just thinking about the logistics of getting some logs, versus, uh, the lumberjack shit, because, you know, on, on all the different, on all the different fronts, I feel, you know, liability injuries, you want to have the lumberjack, you want to have the Northwoods culture, uh, in your show for the tourists, and I think the biggest aspect, the, the best aspect, is, uh, the love rolling, and potentially maybe a boom run, where you can be fall in the water, and that could be real spectator engagement, maybe a little bit of an axe split, but... I, the danger, you know, too much of this logging stuff is, uh, you know, it's it's <laughs> pros and cons. You know what I mean? If you can get a little bit of it in there, but, you know, we don't want to copycat the, co the guys down there either in Ketchikan or in other places. You know, I want to have enough of it, but I want to, you know, stay with the theme of the one dog class. I'm going to stay with the theme of our innovative approach and our, you know, our transformational approach. You know, something with a fishnet, something with... Uh, you know, the idea of getting them the land, getting some berries or something, but also just like the obstacle course, you know, like the, the aspects of a sled push, uh, of, you know, splitting wood, a sled push, and uh, moving across some monkey bars, you know, a spear throw, uh, jumping over a wall, getting down and crawling through some stuff, you know what I mean? And uh, I just asking someone who did an obstacle course online with a fitness thing, you know, what kind of, what are the different things that you did with your obstacle course or whatever, and, um, you know, and trying to take the Alaska history approach, and re not reappropriate it, but, uh, you know, what we're trying to do is come up with something that's going to work for the future, for the future generations, so that they can learn this stuff, and, you know, and uh, if, you, if you're not... If you're just doing the ninja warrior stuff and you're you're not integrating with other stuff, it's not gonna work. And if you're just doing the old stuff and the new stuff, it's not gonna work. So you have to have to have the uh, the innovative approach. Anyway.